Hey everybody, my name is Daniel and I'm a physics and maths tutor at Tutor Tutor. Today I'm going to be doing an AS math class with one of my year 12 students. And I thought it'd be useful if you'd like to come along and see what a one on one online class looks like. Here at Tutor Tutor, we use online classrooms to work with our students, where I can share and go through problem sheets and also use our whiteboards to go through difficult topics. The main online classroom that I use is WizIQ. Here I can share lots of different content and share it with my tutee, such as whiteboards and also problem sheets. When using the whiteboard, I personally use an electronic pen and pad in order to write as it makes it a lot easier to communicate. And the majority of our students also have the same equipment so it's easier for them to answer questions. Using the whiteboard, I can create a lot of different content for myself. For example, here I've looked at integration differentiation. One of the great things about the online classroom is that we can upload real exam papers, which means that we can hone the training as we approach the summer exams to prepare our student to pass an exam and not just have a conceptual understanding of the topics that we cover. Whilst there is a webcam in the classroom, we at Tutor Tutor prefer not to use the webcam, which we can do just by clicking this button. And our students seem to like that fact and do tend to work better without it as a distraction. I'll now show you a little bit of my lesson with one of my students. Hi Josh, how are you doing today? Good, thanks. Yeah, it's been great. Yeah, how's school going? Yeah, it's also good. I mean, I've been doing quite a lot of maths. I've been to Math Society. I've been pretty cool, but I'm enjoying it, so that's great. So we're given this graph here. Um, we have the shaded area and we have a tangent uh, running from A to B. Um, the yeah. first question says, yeah, find dy by dx and hence find the equation of the tangent at A. Okay, so we're going to use differentiation for this one. dy over dn equals, and then I'm going to take the 2 down, so 4x effectively to the 1 minus 3x squared. Perfect. So now because we're at A and x is 2, at A, we're going to put that 2 into this and get the gradient equals 8 minus 12, M equals minus 4. And M being the gradient at which point? At A. Yep, exactly. Okay, right, yeah. Nice one. Hey guys, thank you so much for watching. I hope you found that video useful. If you'd like to find out more about our one-on-one -on -one tutoring at Tutor Tutor, don't hesitate to come and see us by clicking the link down below in the subscription box. Also, if you want to stay up to date with all our videos, don't forget to click the subscribe button here.